Ten students sent to the hospital after smoke caused by a cell phone battery. Yeah, this happened at Maid Creek Junior High School on Greenhouse Road in West Harris County. We are covering the story from every angle, including the students getting medical attention. We want to begin with Hannah McKenzie, who is live at the school with the latest. Hannah? So this all happened just before noon as students were eating lunch in the cafeteria. District officials, though, want to make one thing clear. There was no explosion here today and there were no actual flames. In fact, we got our hands on some video that proves just that. Here's the smoking cell phone. You can see Maid Creek Junior High School faculty pouring water over the device. Seventh grader Shakira Alamshire sent us this video. There was smoke everywhere in the air and people were jumping on tables, yelling, laughing, screaming. She was sitting just a few feet away from it. What, were you scared? Uh, kind of. I mean, I didn't see. There was no fire, so I, was, I thought we were okay. I was kind of difficult breathing. Alamshire tells us another student was slamming a cell phone on the table when it broke in two and the battery began smoking. It scared him just as much as it did everybody else. Katie ISD Police Chief Robert Jinx telling us that student isn't facing disciplinary action. From the video footage, I don't know that... I don't think he intended to do it. I mean, he if you can see him patting the phone, but I don't think he intended for it to catch fire. Ten students were transported to area hospitals for smoke inhalation, and one student sustained thermal burns. But it was probably the student that had the phone. It, you know, I'm sure it got hot and, and burnt their hands, but we don't believe they were transported to the hospital. They went home. Today was a pre-planned early release day for students here at Maid Creek Junior High, and that went on as scheduled. However, a Valentine's Day dance that was planned here for this afternoon was canceled. Reporting live in West Harris County, Hannah McKenzie, KPRC Channel 2 News.